Hello, buddy. Welcome back to another video. I it's been a while, hasn't it? So now we're gonna go back to the place. Yes, I've been. Let's go meet her again, the little one. It's been a while, guys. How you guys been? So I hope you guys enjoy the other gameplay I've been playing on uh, Bloodline on Crunchyroll. Oh my god, here she is. Quick, quick. Forgiveness. We were unable to fulfill our end of the contract. We found, we found no trace of the Coco Goat Adepti Beast of which you speak. Disappointment. Don't, Don't worry, worry about, about it. But, but I feel, I feel very disappointed. disappointed. Oh, poor Chi Chi. Why did Simon feel so guilty all of a sudden? Oh, Coco Goat Adepti Beast. 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 Milk is tasty. Oh, so just <laughs> tasty. Much better than warm goat milk. Only, Only an adaptabeast could make such tasty milk. Okay. I'm sorry. I have a poor memory. I cannot remember the name of the milk. That's why I wrote it down. Where did I put it? Ah, oh, here. This is his name. Coconut milk. Coconut milk. <gasps> so let me get this straight. All she wants cocoa milk. I owe you both an apology. I hastily agreed to what appeared to be an equitable agreement with this zombie child. But perhaps I should have undertaken further due diligence. Never mind, John Lee. You didn't know. As the leader of Covered Moves, all things are random. Um, so, so how, how are you supposed, supposed to predict anything? anything? Literally, Literally no, no one, one could have seen this coming. coming. Excuse, Excuse me, everyone. everyone. Did, did she, she say, say a bad thing? thing? No, you oh. didn't. Sorry, but Pilot's gonna leave the job of sharing this poor kiddo's world to you. It all began with the fruit called the <laughs> coconut. No, impossible. Seems Chi Chi took this pretty hard. She needs a little work. <laughs> oh God! Someone learned a valuable life lesson today. Then, thank you all for looking after my little Chi Chi. Might I ask who? Ah, how, how rude, rude of me. me. I'm, I'm Baiju, boss of the Boo Boo Pharmacy. Boo Boo. I thought that Chi Chi was the boss. Turns out it's, it's so wacko who wears medicinal ingredients around his neck. What a sorry state of affairs. The white snake. So that mascot is even more visible than Chi Chi. Ah, the medicine, the snake is speaking. Wow, a talking snake. Silent, but based with strangers, I must speak, lest you mistake me for an escapee from the medicine cabinet, for I am a living, breathing serpent. <laughs> Don't mind, Chum Chum. 
She's, She's a, a good, good girl, girl, really. As for you three, communal chaos causing with Chi Chi aside, what business brings you here? Do you sell everlasting incense in this fine establishment? Everlasting incense? Why, of course we do. Oh, at last! Things are finally starting to come together! Three million more. Top ball. Jesus Christ! Would they be hiding, hiding in the golden, golden house, house not, not the exuvia? I apologize, but I warned you, didn't I? As the old Yeo saying goes, the walls have ears. Hey. Let's go put the scent. <laughs> Don't know how I'm up or how I get here. <laughs> Yeah. Well, as, as it, it stands, stands we've, we've hired, hired helpers, 
and we've acquired the everlasting incense. The completion of our preparations is not far off. Well, Traveler, have you gained anything from our adventure so far? It's really been odd. odd. <laughs> Which, Which is it, I wonder? The, the questions that such travels raise are ever so complicated. Well, I'll leave you to ruminate over it yourself. As, As to remuneration for your help, I've decided to treat, to treat you to a meal. meal. Oh, ah, uh, yes, yes, don't, don't worry. worry. I will remember to bring more at this time. Tonight, Tonight I shall take you good to an old hole in the wall. Praise to our leader. Hole in a wall? No, it's a game show. <laughs> Indeed. Let, Let us meet you at the heart at third, third round, round knockout. knockout. Sweet. Okay, go to here. Buck, what weapon you use? Bow? Or that weapon? I know you use a spear. No, you use a bow. You one that use a spear. I don't know why. I love people using spears. It makes them more powerful. Because I know she uses a spear. She uses a bow. Yeah, in the next episode, guys, when we finish up this quest, we're going to be doing doing all this. Yeah, we're going to do that next. Here, check what time is it. Make it eight ten military time. I cross, I fall in the water. Why? Damn it, water. Stick. Ah, you're here. There's, There's no, no need, need to order. order. I've already, already done, done so. Some. Third so round knockout is not for lightweights, like, like those taverns in Mondstadt. Here, the, the owner, owner does, does not take, take such unorthodox orders, orders as fruit, fruit juice. juice. So. 
Does this mean I can order wine at this time? I ordered, I ordered some, some wine, wine fermented, fermented sweet, sweet rice. Bowl. Yes! If wine! If it is to your liking, dear customers, I shall continue the tale of Lady Ming Guan's Jade Chamber. Hey! There's even a storyteller here! Great atmosphere! Besides fine wine, the excellent ambiance is the reason why this place is so well loved. But, but when, when I, I say ambiance, I refer to a different sort from the one that that travel guide uses to judge other establishments. establishments. As you all know, high above the land of Mira lies a pavilion in the clouds, a palace in the mist. What does it mean to have all-seeing eyes? This, my friends, Lady Ningguan's masterwork that bridges earth and sky. Imagine. The weather is clear, and you gaze down from the deck on the world below. Behold, the glorious sights of Liyue Harbor, stretching oh God. far and wide. They say that when Lady Ningguang ponders important affairs, she retreats to her jade chamber with none. But her, but her three closest confidants in tow. Why, Why brings she these trusted three to, to sift through sources, dig through documents, documents looking for information? information. Piece, piece by piece, piece facts, facts and figures paint a picture, picture on the walls of the chamber. chamber. But, but well, well before the wall is filled, Lady Ningguang's mind is made. Having made her, her call, she has, has every last document in shredded, shredded, and whoosh, she scatters the shavings out her window. Ah, oh, look at them, how they billow in the wind like a sudden swirling blizzard. As the fragments fall, traces of text flicker before the eyes of the merchants of Nia, like ink stains and white snow. The saying goes, the rarest treasures in the land are the words brought by the paper snow. For the words of the Tianquan have the power to move mountains, and all throughout the land know it. These are but scraps of paper. And yet they guide Lady Ningguang's hand. Such is their value. Merely grasping one or two of them will surely gift you a fragment of her wisdom. Enough to stay a step or two ahead of your peers. Tianquan Ningguang. Feels like we're hearing this name a lot. Li locals talk about her. The Fatui hate her. She's most likely the one who hid the Exuvia, and we saw her at the Rite of Dissension. Huh. Hyman wonders what sort of person she is. At last, I have found you. You who returned from Juayun Karst. Who's there? Parma, we got to go. Wait. I am not with, with the Merlin, nor am I here to play with the bounty. However, I am an emissary of the Liyue Chising. My name is Ganyu, secretary at the Yuahai Pavilion, and I have come specifically to meet you. Well, in concrete terms, I am the corporate secretary for the Chising. At the moment, I am serving as Lady Ningguang's special emissary. Ningguang sent you? We were literally just talking about her! My apologies, you who have returned from Jiayun Karst. I am duty-bound and cannot extend my courtesy to you in full. But I have with me a letter from Lady Ningguang. She extends a formal invitation to you in her capacity as Tianquan. She invites you to her palace in the sky. What? An official invitation? We've been invited! Lady Ningguang said this. Invite him to come here. I wish to meet him. At the Jade Chamber, 
Together, we shall snip every one of these entwining dark threads. I'm always mine and mine. Karma is up to something again. An invitation to visit the Jade Chamber is a rare honor indeed. You'd best be on your way now. But don't forget about the right of party. Once you've finished at the Jade Chamber, meet me at Dihua Marsh. Don't worry, we won't forget. Dihua Marsh. We'll see you there. So I guess we can't go see her. Did we lock that level? Oh, fuck. Well, I guess I'll be working into this. So I'm going to end the video here. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you guys do like it, please hit the subscribe button. And also, oh, before I forget. I know you guys, I know I told you guys last time I'm working on a manga. I want to know something for you guys. I'm trying to find a good title for my manga. I'm still working on it. I haven't got started on it. But I want you guys to help. Give me some, some great ideas for this manga I'm working on. I want this ma manga to be working with, like, like I want it to be a venture different world and funny romantic drama action and all the basically all the anime you guys watch I'm gonna do all of it in one anime one manga every one of the spirit and all that so uh, what I'm trying to say I want to make a manga that with all of those options, like all drama, romance, action, comedy, fighting, or whatever. But I'll let you guys know, I will tell you guys what it's going to be going to action by. It's going to be a one guy trying to find this one, one item he lost. Technically, no. Scratch that. He's trying to find some way to save his world. Trying to save everyone. And he's fighting a big ass. He got a robot he's fighting. But his team is going to be the same thing as if you guys saw the rest of the enemy, like you saw. This one animation, uh, Darling of Frank. You. you guys need to that animation. I love that animation. It's gonna be a blue like it. It's gonna be, it's gonna be with robots fighting, humans patrolling them, and it's gonna be drama and all that. And also gonna be like, I thought I'd show you guys that later down the road when I'm working on it. So I want to say, give me some ideas if you guys want me to do for the anime and for the manga. It's your choice. You guys can do, say whatever you want down in the comments. Just give me some questions or answers. Give me some questions. Give me something you guys want to have as manga. So let me know down in the comment section below. And hit the like button if you guys want more of this video. I know you guys have been missing this series too. And I'm going to say, this is my thing. This 
This is Dylan and Garth. Games and see you guys in the next video. Make sure to comment down below down in the comment section. What do you guys want on this anime? This comment or manga or whatever you call it. Manga. I wanna hear you guys' comments. I really wanna I want I've been reading you guys' comments. I've been reading some of you guys' comments already. So make sure to comment down below what kind of you want on this manga series I'm making. So I'll make that happen. No one ever asked anything else the normal youtuber asked you guys what do you guys want on this manga so i'll see you guys next time and talk to you guys later goodbye make sure to hit the subscribe button too if you guys won't miss another video of mine bye